hello and welcome or welcome back to my channel today i am so excited because i'm going to be trying out some lip products from merit merit is a minimalistic beauty brand that is new to sephora and this video was really exciting for me because they sent me their entire line of lip oils to try out for you guys and like that to me is an honor because like who am i like y'all want me to try out your lip products like okay okay go me but seriously it is an honor that brands are actually reaching out to me and wanting me to try their things like that is huge for me so i'm really grateful and appreciative and i promise to always give you guys my honest opinion even if brands send me stuff like i'm gonna give you guys my true and honest thoughts you can't buy me i cannot be bought my my opinion cannot be bought this is the package that they sent over i already took the lip oils out of the packaging and this is what they look like look at that packaging look at that packaging very very luxury something really cute that i thought that i should mention is when you place an order at meritbeauty.com for the first time they send you this cute little bag like it's just like a little makeup bag you can just throw it in your bag or whatever but i think it's so cute i like the um corduroy fabric and just in case anyone is curious this is what their packaging looks like like i said i took everything out of the packaging just to make this video flow a little bit smoother so i don't have to be sitting here opening them one at a time you know but we're gonna dive into these lip oils they do have like tints to them so i'm hoping that we get some you know enough pigment to like make this video worthwhile and look at these beautiful shades so the first shade that i'm going to try out for you guys is a natural i think that's how you pronounce it this is what the shade looks like oh this is pretty this is very pretty and hydrating and i was not expecting all of this pigment like yes ma'am what do we think what do we think it's very comfortable on the lips i did try one out and did a wear test like for a day so i can give you guys my honest feedback on the actual formula and the formula is good y'all formula is good the next shade we're gonna try out is marrakesh Ooh why does this look so good like i love this shade how would i even describe this shade i don't even know it looks like my lips but better i'm really impressed with this shade because i feel like it's very universal like it will look good on anybody okay the next shade that we're gonna try out is taupe Ooh, i'm already in love okay so far out of the three shades i tried this is my favorite one it is the absolute perfect nude like you can't get a better nude on my skin tone than this this is the perfect nude period okay that shade was beautiful but the next shade that we're gonna try on here is pink beet and this is what it looks like i just cannot get over the packaging for these this shade is not something i would choose for myself it's very pink on me but it is pretty it will look pretty on someone it just i don't think it compliments me very well but you guys comment down below and let me know what you think because i tend to stay right in my comfort zone and i need to step out and i just don't know what looks good on me as far as lips because i feel like my mouth is kind of big so i don't know i don't know i don't know now the next shade is called cara cara this shade is different for me it's like a burnt orange but i think it looks really pretty i actually like this one like i feel like it's not in my comfort zone but i actually really like this one i think it's also my shirt that's making me like this a little bit more because it kind of just goes with my vibe today but yeah this this shade is actually really pretty okay we're down to our last two the next shade is called sangria Ooh, the name is very fitting yeah this shade is everything this is just a lip oil and it's it's giving much more than a lip oil this is so pretty i feel like it matches my blush today i have on the elf always spicy blush and i feel like it just these look good together okay and last but not least we have the shade falcon 
a very chocolatey brown. A chocolate brown is always very, very much necessary. I'm excited to see what this looks like. How pretty is this shade? Comment down below, let me know how pretty it is. I already know the shade is pretty, but comment down below and let me know how pretty this shade is. Okay guys, that was all seven shades. They do also have a clear shade, but I don't have that one. I only have the seven shades with pigment to it. So those are what I tried out for you guys today. A clear is just gonna be a clear, but as far as the formula goes, 10 out of 10 i really enjoyed every single shade there was one shade i can't remember which one it was but i felt like it was a little too pink for me but i i don't know i'm gonna let you guys decide the formula is good the packaging is excellent the only thing i would change i would make the applicator bigger i feel like it's a little small but besides that i rate these a 10 out of 10. when i did a wear test with these i wore it for the whole maybe not the whole day but like most of the day and it kept my lips moisturized and even after it wore off my lips didn't feel dry and that's like a big huge deal for me because i don't like products that like once they wear off your lips feel super dry and you feel like you have to keep applying it over and over i don't get that vibe from these i actually love these and i look forward to using these like on a regular basis i was thinking if i would compare these to the dior lip oil I feel like when it comes to moisturization, yes, yes, definitely. When it comes to glossiness, I feel like the DR lip oil is glossier. But when it comes to pigment, these, these are it. I really feel like these will be perfect in the summer as well. If I had to pick my top three, hmm, my top three would be Sangria, Taupe, and falcon these are my top three these are my comfort shades but the honorable mention is definitely cara cara i really liked the way this looked on me and i was surprised that i liked the way it looked on me because like i said like these nudes are my comfort zone so yeah definitely had to mention this when it comes to favorites because it did impress me but that is it for this video i really enjoy trying out new brands so i hope you guys are open and receiving to me trying new brands on my channel and stuff like that this brand seems promising so i'm excited to try more things from them in the future and yeah thank you guys again for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video